Oh man, I turn to run around with the skeleton hand, yeah. Hello? You're still alive. Who is this? It's happening again. For uh, R.L. Stein, it's, uh, it's a classic writer on this genre. And have you read any of his books before or even Fear Street before the project? Yeah, lots of Goosebumps. Yeah. Goosebumps is like a very big part of my life for many, <laughs> many years. Yeah. And did you ever imagine she would be in one of your stories? I really never thought I would be. Same. I don't think it was anything that ever crossed my mind. Um, and then when I got this, I was like, oh, this is my chance, like, to be in something a part of this, that's part of this universe. Yeah. Yeah, like if you told us as kids that we would be, you know, <laughs> yeah. doing an R.L. Stein trilogy, the same author who wrote Goosebumps that we were, like, obsessed with, like, it, it would be so hard to believe. So yeah. Yeah. there's still something about it that's still a little surreal. Yeah. Definitely. Definitely. You know, always that when, when we talk with actors that been in this kind of project, they always talk about how, so, some weird things that happen and said or scary things. There was any scary moment that you went through while while shooting? Hmm. I feel like we were we were often looking for scary things because we <laughs> yeah. wanted something scary. Like we filmed in an in an abandoned hospital and we were like Today's the day, guys. Yeah, something we're gonna, happened. Yeah, something we were gonna like, we got to explore the rooms. Yeah, but then nothing. It down. was just a building. <laughs> yeah, and then we filmed at the mall that was kind of abandoned. We were like, maybe at the mall. Yeah, it's gonna be, and then it never was. <laughs> no. Nope. But boy, oh boy, did we try. Um, well, something really important about this movie, besides, of course, uh, horror, it's uh, we get some LGBT representation. We're not on Pride Month. And mm -hmm. I think it's a huge step that you get to play these characters that, of course, it, it, they, they have some issues with, with the whole thing, but it is totally natural that we get to see it. And how do you feel, guys, with, with this? I don't know. I feel um, very lucky to get to be part of it, and it feels, yeah, like you said earlier, that it's, like, about time. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah, it is. You know what I mean? Like, it shouldn't be um, as, like, you know, groundbreaking as it is that this is going down, but... It feels very lucky that we're at like we're at the forefront of this like change in cinema yeah. and in movies mm. and um, that the the tides are starting to change and that there's like just more representation that's like normalized in these movies and, mm -hmm. um, yeah. and yeah and and even you know as the story continues throughout the films like we kind of dive into that even deeper and you know mm -hmm. just the idea of of you know feeling like you've been oppressed, feeling like you've been judged, feeling like you've been told that you can't achieve something, that you're never gonna have the life that you deserve. We really shine a light on that. And like, you know, Shady Side is, is a bunch of like outsiders who mm -hmm. come together and they overcome their circumstances. And I think that's so powerful for the queer community and for minorities as a whole, you know, people of color, women, everyone, mm -hmm. you know, I think, the representation in these films is so important and, and we're really grateful to be a part of a project that focuses on that. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's, it's awesome how diverse we are as a cast, how mm -hmm. diverse the story mm -hmm. is in itself. Like there's yeah. so many different things that are just like all coming together, like different genres. There's so many different stories. Uh, I'm not going to ask you which is your favorite horror movie, but I would like to know if you get to play the villain on one horror movie, which would it be? Ooh. Michael Myers from Halloween. <laughs> yeah, you love That's Michael Myers. Myers. Yeah, yeah, Michael Myers. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Um, it, you know, it'd be very fun to play, play Freddy Krueger. Yeah. I'll do yeah. it. I'll be female Freddy Krueger. Watch me. Uh, you know, I'm going to say... That would be nice. I could see it. It would be fun to play a Fear Street villain like Ruby Lane. Yeah. Mm. Ruby Lane is, like, really cool, mm. really creepy and super feminine, which we don't see a lot of villains, you know, in horror films being yeah. like feminine and, and, and terrifying. Yeah. So I think that's pretty badass. So that'd be yeah. cool to play. Great choices. And thank you guys so much. So I really hope the movie does great because it's, it's amazing. Thank, thank you. you. Bye. 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 Try not to die. Welcome to the suck. Come back from that mother...